Too many games coming out. Well, look at this bird up there. Well, that's super nifty. Is this bird, like, killable? Or is this somebody's pet? Oh, it's definitely somebody's pet. <laughs> that bird didn't even care. Well, welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West, you wonderful humans. I figured we would uh, start continuing through the story. I believe we have to keep going all the way into the west. So if we go into our quests here, the active quest that we need to partake in is the Broken Sky. Now this is for level 17, and I've subsequently gotten to level 20 by using a little bit of a cheesy method that I recorded a video on uh, for taking down, down some thunder, do thunder, does. <laughs> thunder Jaws for like XP and money, which has been making my life a little bit easier. Uh, I would like to upgrade one of my weapons soon too, but there's like so many different ways familiar. you can get like free weapons and stuff in this game. So we'll have to start going over some of that soon. But yeah, I really hope enjo everybody enjoys today's playthrough. Thank you so much for the support so far. Like right in the eye, what if the owner comes after you? That's a, that's a good question. I don't have a good response for that, unfortunately. So we have to go all the way... Wow, I guess it is kind of far, but also not super far. But there's also like this fire bristleback site. And there's a fire bristleback over there. Which I think we need to take down so we can unlock the stuff for being able to actually override bristlebacks. Which I think would be fun. Paprika! This game is so cool. It's super cool. I love it. It's definitely my favorite open world game since Red Dead Redemption 2. Is it better than Red Dead Redemption 2? No, I don't think there's going to be much that ever becomes better than Red Dead, but... We gotta get them pouch upgrades. Look at those. That horned lizard. Nice. I believe this is a vulture. Perfect. But it didn't have the vulture item that I'm looking for. There's like a ton of different items that I need for upgrading my pouches. And has not been necessarily easy to find. Ooh. Oh, it's a tall neck that we get to override so we can find out more information about the area. It's yesterday's stream because I went to see Uncharted. Lil Bean, did you like it? What did, what did y'all think? What did you think? Y'all? You? Somebody? Oh, what the hell is that thing? Oh my god, what are you? It's you're like, like a little anteater, dude. Whoa! Oh my god! Okay, your bellies are super vulnerable. Good lord. Oh my god. That sucks having such a vulnerable spot like that. That's a design flaw if I've ever seen one. Good lord. Ah. Oh my god. <laughs> I almost feel bad because they're so adorable. I just killed a whole family. Yeah, they're anteaters. Wow. Moonchild. Thank you for the sub. Don't How are you doing? I miss Tallneck. Is that another one? Ah! Dang. You really hate Pango, bro? Ah! Oh. Oh. What is... What's going on here? Oh, why? Leave me alone. I know I killed your whole family, but <laughs> come on. Leave me alone. Samantha, thank you for the prime sub. And governor watching this live. Oh, oh my god. Good lord. Boom. Nailed it. There's like a lot of little bits that come flying off of these dudes too. Wow. Oh, they're like little resource containers. That's nifty. That. That was weird. Alright, so now that I've massacred the entire population of anteaters, I feel like I should, I don't know, pay like respects or something? I, I don't know. I feel pretty bad about it. Watching this live is weird. I've been watching at 100% speed to catch up. Oh my god, governor. <laughs> I'm so sorry. 
It's nuts. Oh my god, are these all Apex Shredders? What are these things? I don't think they're Apexes. Oh, they don't even want to fight. Huh. So how do we get up to this long neck? That's what I want to know. They're like little wolves, but not horribly aggressive wolves? What are you? Oh, oh. Okay. Give me your items. It's a Ravager. Oh. Yeah, Ravager. Oh my god. Ravagers were from the first one, right? Okay. Die. Die. Thank you. Holy guacamole, Batman. There we go. Good lord. Dude, I want to pick up some of them laser beams. this thing? We got the burrower. There we go. Oh, another little toad dude. Come here. Did I kill it? It was a horned lizard. Uh, the OG Matt. What's going on? It is hot. It is hot indeed. So we got to figure out how to get on top of this dude's head. And I don't really see a way up there. Like, there's definitely nothing to hook to. It's got no little pieces to grab onto up there to even climb up to the neck. Oh. This one we get to unlock later. Well, that's, that's frustrating. Oh, look at this dude over here. Is that another thunder shot? Oh, it is. <laughs> I'm a pass on that. Definitely am not about that thunder jaw life right now. But good lord, look at how pretty this game is. <gasps> bird. Stupid bird. But you don't go flying around me, boy. Good action movie bonus scene at the end. It was a good time. That's good. I was very concerned that it was going to end up being pretty terrible, to be honest. Snap. Um, I guess it's on like Donkey Kong. That bird's like, oh, hell no, I'm out of here. Oh, 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 it's magic. You know, stupid dragon. It's a dinosaur, but still. Woo. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. Those things you knock off its back are absolutely killer. <laughs> oh my god, no! That antelope was like, oh, snap. I've gone into the danger zone. <laughs> oh, really, bro? Get out of here. Nobody likes you. Oh, my God. I've been shooting the wrong type of arrow that whole time. No wonder I was doing so bad. Dang. Yeah, welcome to Horizon Forbidden West. We'll see how this goes. Good lord. And them thunder job parts, baby. Is that a little sheep? What are you? Aw. Oh, it's a little baby pig. Oh, it's a pe 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 peckery. We need those for uh, one of our pouch upgrades. I think we need a purple item from one. The regular item. 
There's more of those ant eaters, which we already know. Die super. That bird just exploded. What the hell? Do we still have our mount? Oh, look at our little raptor friend. Nice. I thought I killed him last night accidentally. Uh, little Lizzie, thank you for the sub and for the eight months. Thank you so much. Oh, these dudes are very slow, by the way. It's their one downside. I'm gonna keep my sanity right now. Zoe, I'm watching a husky who no one told isn't... Oh, it's not housebroken and my apartment. Please send help. You poor soul. I am so sorry to hear that. Oh my goodness. Look at this biome change. I'm Dang. getting close to Aether's location. Guy said it would be in some kind of physical processor. It would be in some kind of physical processor, huh? We're in like a desert oasis. I love that biome change. Like, went through the hills. We've got this whole fancy area. Super pretty. Uh, Pocket Keeks, thank you for the prime sum. The sweet, sweet Bezos bucks. Are you streaming on Twitch exclusively now? No, just uh, doing it today. An ancient ruin. Turned into a Tanakh stronghold? Could we go outside and he still pees on my clothes? Oh my god, Zoe. Poking around's not going to be easy with Tanakh's warriors everywhere. Soldiers killed since. And Regala's army only grows in strength. She struck. Regala's forces may seem strong now. But Her machines took out my entire squad. Remember the visions. The old ones didn't choose their fight, but still they stood firm. They didn't falter. And neither will we. A Waffles King, welcome. Blood of the Ten. You've come to us. You know who I am? Oh. The warrior with hair like wildfire who defeated Regala's champion at Baron Light. <laughs> yes, you are known to us. I am Decca, chaplain of the Lowland clan. You've come to speak with Chief Hikaro. Not quite. There's, there's something I need here. Anything you need, the chief will provide. Come. Y'all got some good weapons? I need some upgrades. Is that one of the visions you were talking about? Yes. The records of the Ten. I can show you them, if you like. On the way to the Chief. I am curious about the... the visions. These visions. You said they're the records of the Ten. Who are they? Old ones. Who fought a heroic battle against machines on this very soil long ago. Their deeds are honored in the visions. <laughs> At least what remains of them. To be remembered and exalted. There used to be more of these visions? Many more. Once this place was filled with light and sound. But over the years, they've fallen into darkness. One by one. That is why chaplains are so important to the tribe. We remember all we can of the visions, etched in our flesh, passed down by word of mouth from generation to generation. One day the whole grove may go dark, but chaplains who come after me will keep the memories alive. That is some very interesting arm armor, just uh, throwing that out there. Annalise, thank you for the Bezos bucks, and you guys at work wanted to pop in and say what's up? Welcome! And uh, Jay Dola, welcome as well. All right, let's go see Chief Akaro. He's in his throne room at the far Dude, end of the Dude, I grove. want a throne room. Come, be welcome among the records of the Ten. When does Aloy get her own thro throne room? I feel like she should have like 10 of them by now. I definitely want to look more into this G.I. Joe shenaniganry over here. It's glitched, incomplete. Was this a TV show? Oh my god, I bet they've been worshipping a TV show. As, as best we can. Joint Force 10 at Led by Body weapons were the battle. Huh. 
I totally people. think they were worshiping the like were dedicated a movie or TV working show. Working together as a squad and sharing in their duty. G.I. Genova. And when the time came for battle, they took to the skies and leaped to glory. Hold on. All yeah. Tanakh seek to follow their example. They've a hundred percent been watching a, a been worshiping a TV show. Oh my God. Hold on, let me read this data point. I bet, I bet if we can read one of these, it's about a TV show. Uh, exhibit allows us to hear their final moments using an interference donated by Sterling Malkeet. We can listen to any flight record that employs the industry standard Air FR encryption protocol. Okay, so maybe it's not a TV show. I was really hoping that it would be, though. Is this true? Oh, and you rose. Thank you. Oh, what's this dude? What you got? You have an old world recording? This box was speaking with voices of the old ones. But now there's noise over them. Let me take a look. That has to be the least effective this? chest armor I've ever we seen in my from entire an life. Delver. She was trying to steal it and other artifacts from Tanakh territory. She's literally got feathers. With her. But then I heard the voices. Her armor. Well, the data here is badly corrupted, but Delta Juliet 9, you are weapons free and clear to engage the swarm. Good hunting. Copy that. We'll buy Zero Dawn the time you need. Delta Juliet 9, out. The voices of warriors from the past. And that Osiram wanted to sell them for shards. The bravery of the Ten should be remembered. I'm not sure what you mean by the Ten. These voices came from the final battle of the Old Ones. Another battle? I could learn more about it if I could find the other boxes. That Delver did say there might be more recordings to be found in the wreckage of ancient flying machines. She claimed she had a way to locate them. Yeah. The box with the voice data on it is emitting a locator signal. I could use it to find the others. Well, if that's you cool. Do, then, bring them back here. I will see to it that they're treated with proper respect. Whatever sacrifices were made by these ancient soldiers. We will I'll get you that. some good chest armor too, because I'm a little scared you're gonna have like a, an accident there. If I find more of those recordings, I'll bring them back to you. You think it's propaganda from the civilian army that fought the swarm? I mean, it might very well be. My focus can detect beacons from those recording devices. Should help me to find any others that are still out there. My God, look at this one. This one's crazy. All right, so where's the leader at? We gotta find that throne room. There we go. Ooh, this is pretty. Ah, uh, diggity dang. Ah, uh, Miss Crimson, have a wonderful day. And Circle Girt, thank you for the sub. Are you ready to see him? I'm ready. I'm ready. Good. Come. Wait, have they been worshipping? There's not even a person. Is this a trap? It's underneath the throne. Oh, no, we're good. Oh, it's the dude who lost an arm. I forgot about him. The savior of Meridian. I am told you held back Regala's forces outside Baron Light. And defeated her champion, Grutta, in single combat. Impressive. I met Fashav there, too. He said you were a great warrior and a man of honor. His death is a painful loss among many. We will not soon recover from the massacre of our marshals. But if you are here to pledge your service, that could help considerably. I am not here to fight for you. I need something in that basement. Something that will save many lives, yours included. It's not something you can see, but it is there. I have seen it. 
Interesting. You have named your price. Now I name mine. With my marshals dead, I need your spear. And we can murder f some people for him. Help me defeat my enemies, and I will grant you access to the chamber below. I don't have a price. I am not a hired killer. I'm here to save lives, more than you can count. I count the corpses of Marshal slain. I count hundreds more to knock whose lives hang in the balance. I will fight for them. Is this the State Farm dude voice? Who threatens the peace, and you will too, if you want me to open the door to the chamber below. Okay. So by that logic, what's stopping me from killing you right now? And taking what I need to save everyone. That's not how you make friends, Aloy. You could try. You might even succeed. Either way, you must fight. My way might hold off Regala and the slaughter she craves. Fine. What do you need? I need more marshals to keep the tribe together. Such warriors can only be promoted at a trial by combat called the Cool Route. I've sent out a call for the competition, but since Regala seeks to undermine me, she is certain to attack it. She'll want to kill me in front of the assembled clans. So what, you want me to be your bodyguard? No, to defend the Cool Route. But there is more. Knowing Regala will attack, one of the clans have balked at sending their contestants. You must go north and force Takote, the commander of the Sky Clan, to submit and send his best. Force him to submit? Do whatever is necessary. I can't hold a cool route with two of the three clans in attendance. Marshal Katala will assist you. He was maimed at Baron Light, but he can still be of use. I sent him ahead to the northern village of Stone Crest. Meet him there, and he will guide you to the Sky Clan stronghold. If you have any questions about your mission, now is the time. I feel pretty confident about this without needing to have more information about it. Like, we know everything about all of these things now, so, I mean, we're just going to go north. Want, and go north to deal with We ain't about playing games. But you'd be about saving about the deal. world. You will have what was promised if you succeed. Speak to Deco on your way out. She will arm you for the road ahead. Ooh. We get some free weapons? This guy is voiced by Gino Sagers and 190 bits for tacos. Thank you, Lindsay. Thank you very much. Appreciate you. Um. He, he was in Banshee as Big Navajo Native, and if you know it, you know he is insane. He was insane. Yeah, his voice is, uh, is something, that's for sure. I can hear every voice. So we need to go and pimp slap a dude that rules the sky. And I'm thinking maybe we get a new key item or something Donna, from this fine lady. Speak. Hello, Deca. Carl said you have something for me? A weapon to aid your mission. You'll well, need it for the you, long road to Stonecrest. Many machines prowl along the way, and our scouts have sighted Regala's rebels in the area. Machines and rebels. Nothing I haven't faced before. That Indeed. is true. Head north towards the foothills. Ascend its slopes until your legs burn and the chill air catches in your chest. Then you'll know you're in the Sky Clan's domain. Strike true as the ten, Aloy. Yes, ma'am. What did we get? So we got a cleaving sharp shot bow. Ooh. Sharp shot bows are powerful, highly accurate, long range weapons. They have reduced accuracy either. when fired while moving, but cannot be aimed while sliding. I better meet up with Marshal Catalo at Stonecrest. Okay. He'll be faster so, if I ride a machine. Yeah, we need it. We definitely need a faster machine. How far are we going? Oh, that's not that bad. Plus, there's a relic ruin nearby, which is pretty cool. And Stonecrest really, I mean, that's not that bad. I feel pretty good about that. So let's go into our inventory and check out this new weapon that we got. We got the cleaving sharp shot bow. Dang. Draw speed. 
All right, let's equip one of these bad boys. And I think we're going to replace the... I don't know what I want to replace. The Frost Hunter bow? Yeah, we'll replace the Hunter bow, I guess. The regular Hunter bow that we have. And then we could probably upgrade that bad boy too. So tear precision arrows are now available from one of your sharp shot bows. These powerful arrows do your high tear damage with a compressed air blast. Use them to remove armor plates from tough opponents to detach useful components. Oh, hell yeah. Awesome. Beautiful. Um, now the question is... Oh, wow. We can only carry six or two at a time. Dang. Well, that's less, less good. Far less good, in fact. Alright, I think what I'm going to have to do... I like the warrior bow, but I don't like it nearly as much as the hunter bow. So we have the cleaving sharp shot bow. That's the one we have equipped. I think... Yeah, we're going to keep using the hunter bow, I guess, for now. Um, in replace of of the warrior bow that we have. Wait, what's the warrior bow damage? Yeah, the warrior bow damage is not very good. There we go. That's better. So now we have just three bows we get to whip people with. Let's see if we can tame one of these. Oh, yeah, we can totally tame one of those. That's one of the big pig dudes. This is going to be the first time taming one. Welcome to the taco army. Hell yeah. Uh, at Nets, AT Nettles. You know, you'd think after six months, I would know how to say your name. Thank you. I need to search Welcome more back. cauldrons to learn how to override that. What? I can't override it? What is it? Oh, it's a fire bristleback. That's why. And it's only level 13. It does have different items that we might need to do. So we need to detach its horns. Which I clearly haven't done yet. Oh, hot diggity. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, well that bow did a lot of damage. That's nice. I'm gonna need another one of them bristleback tusks. Let's go, baby. Uh, Psycho Hair, thank you for the sub. I wish Twitch would just automatically use my Prime sub. Yeah, you know, it's super, super dumb that it doesn't do that. I'm not exactly sure why. I mean, I know why, because, uh, you know, Jeff Bezos doesn't want to be giving away all of the free money every month automatically, so they make you got to work for that free money, right? The wealth distribution. This free 250. Two your favorite streamers. My taco is half full because of this. <laughs> Nothing worse than a half full taco. What is this area all about? Like some. Oh, I bet that's like where the training pit's gonna be. If I were a betting man. Alright, what do we got up here? Oh, it's just one of these antler dudes, right? You see nothing. Or do you see everything? She's on to me. Oh! Uh. Oh! Bad oh. touch! Bad touch! Bad touch! All right, fine. I just wanted to find something to ride. You know, I think the only fast thing that I can ride right now are the chargers. Still, though, I was thinking maybe one of those dudes would be tameable. not sure if they are but I do want to find out I think it would be fun just to light things on fire with one okay. oh you stupid ram <laughs> Alright, it can't see me anymore, so I'm just going to let it de-aggro, and then we'll hop on it. 
I would love it if they turn this into a survival game. It would be great to make a house in this world. Right? I wish we had a survival game that looked this pretty. Like, good lord. There you go. Back to what you were doing. I mean, Ark Survival Evolved 2 has a chance of being this pretty. I don't know if it will be. Oh, snap. Come here. Whoops, I missed. Dang it. All right, let's not waste any more time with that. Apparently I just suck. I have a raptor that I could ride, but it's not, it's, it's not fast. Red Dead Online survival mode would be the best ever. I mean, they're just never gonna do it though. Like honestly, just being able to live and have that actually truly become a survival game would be amazing. Like actually being able to do like homesteading and stuff like that and like fully build out your house and like have to get equipment and stuff would be so freaking cool. That roller back ammo. Oh, it looks like we have a big apex monster up here. You see what that's all about. Oh, is that a, that's a ravager site. So that's going to be an apex ravager up there. I think I'm going to, I think I'm going to hard pass that one. Sassy Ramon. Thank you for the prime sub. All right, so are these things rideable? I should probably scan it Machine first. Like so Lance Horn. Yeah. It's unlocked through the IOTA stuff, which we already have. It's unlocked. It doesn't look like something I can ride, but maybe. Oh my god, spicy. <laughs> Alright. We're gonna try and ride this one. Nope, so it's only a silent strike. Not rideable. I've been made. There's some raptors up here, though. The problem is, like, I have a raptor, but they move so slow. Oh, snap. Bruh. Aw. It's so sad when you hit them in their butts and they just kind of fall over and die. It's so sad. Ooh, Lancehorn Drill Horns. I guess maybe that'll be worth farming up real quick. Oh my god. If I could stop missing. Oh, right in the dome. You almost feel bad killing these things sometimes. Hey, Emily. How have you been? Hope things are going well. What's going on? Get this from my stash when I need it. We do have some more weaves that we can use too. I just want to make sure to unlock these fireplaces as we go. Like a little. So those are raptors. I can tame those, but they're super slow. Want it to be freaking daytime. Lots of raptors coming through. Acid bristleback sight. Oh, Emily. Well, I'm glad to hear things are getting better. That's good. Dude, that thing was like. Mm -hmm. help me here. So 
So we have we have those partially unlocked. I'm going to kill these because then I'll get the items that I need to fully unlock them. Oh, God. Oh, why do I keep getting into fights without ammo? Stupid. Oh, I just missed. Oh my God, it's so many angry hippos. Oh. Oh. Good Lord. Hungry, hungry hippos times 10. <laughs> the world's angriest hip -hop anonymous is. Oh. No, no! Jesus! Oh. oh my god! Where the hell did that thing come from? Oh, and there's an apex one here too. <laughs> Gotta get him in the booty. No. Maybe if we go up on this rock, then they won't really be able to hit me. <laughs> Maybe they won't be able to hit me up here. the longest night ever. Oh. Oh. I escaped it, but got caught in the fire a little bit. Oh. Dang, I love that show. Yeah, I used to watch Roly Poly Oli all the time when I was a kid. Dude's rolling out like Roly Poly Oli right now. Jesus. Oh. Oh. Much better. Healer and things do I have left? Not many. <laughs> Ooh, baby. There we go. So I now should have everything I need, hopefully be able to tame both of these things. I'll have to go back to like our main base of operations though to like learn it. Tag has clearly never met a hippo. Those things are just mean. I mean, yeah. So hippos are like some of the most deadliest creatures on earth. That's 100% true. Definitely not wrong. These dudes down here just watched all that transpire. And did not do anything about it. Craft ammo tag? <laughs> yeah, you're right, you're right. Two, three, and three. I'll rejuvenate all of our stuff. I 
Dang, I was low on everything. All right. Bucho Bettero. Boom. Uh, just Justin Dragon Tamer. Thank you for the prime sub. Hey, Tag, get all the parts, woo. Oh, yeah. I think I'm going to need sticks soon. I guess not. Still doing pretty good on sex. Plus, we can always just buy the sticks in the steeper. future. Air's getting cold. Should be getting close to stone crust. This up here. Sheer side climb, huh? Oh, there's a weapon vendor up there. My strength is yours. What you got? Give me them goods. Ah, uh, they're just coils and weaves. You know my stock. Return when you need it. Got excited for no reason. And then we can figure out if we want to... I don't think we need to upgrade our bow that we have. Should be okay without it. But what I do want to do... We're going to do a quick save... Oh no, you're out of life cereal? The best cereal. If we go back to the base, right here. Oops. We can see if we have everything to be able to tame those roller dudes and the hippopotamus boys. Oh, my fingers feel stiff in this cold. Because I, I think they're going to be faster than the raptors. It'd at least be fun to experiment with. It's so easy to get distracted in this game because it's like there's so many different little like side quests and things to do. All right. Okay, there we go. The roller back. We can craft the override for that. It's super cool. And then did we get everything for... Nope. Okay. We need one more Sky Drifter Razor Talon. And if we want to ride the Plow Horn, we need to kill a bunch of those. But we at least got the Roller Back dudes. Also, the Ravager Override. We just need a Ravager Primary Nerve. I'm surprised we haven't gotten one of those yet. We're going to have to murder some at that uh, little Ravager camp. You'd think doors in the future times would be automatic, but... Just me? I think this one is. Nope. Gotta open every door. So we were... There's Shearside Climb. We got Acid Bristle Bro, dude. That's the Thunderjaw site. There's a Charger site there. Hunting grounds. I guess we're kind of committed to being at this place. Outlander, I offer you an honorable trade. Good day, warrior. You have warrior. nothing of interest, lady. I'm sorry. I'll grab this rest, Ash later. He's out here trying to trade me garbage. The echoing in this cavern here is super nice. Even the snowy areas are super pretty. I think one of the best snowy areas that I've seen in the game was Assassin's Creed Valhalla. But this looks just as good. We need to get Aloy some warm clothes though. Hot diggity dang. Like the snowy area in Red Dead Redemption 2 also looked really good, but... Kind of thing we got up there. 
Got pigs. Like, what are the, what are pigs doing up in the cold areas? Oh, that's an owl. I missed. Uh, yep. This must be Stonecrest. Catalo <laughs> should be waiting for me. <laughs> I thought I had to like jump across first. the little rocks. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, I see where I was supposed to run across now. <laughs> You'd think they just know how to make a good bridge. Oh my god, I almost died. Good lord. These people are like, screw bridges, man. I want to get drunk and die. All right, let's see if this person has some hey. good items. They've got a bellow blast spike thrower. Ooh, it's an upgraded spike thrower. We need an elemental claw strider circulator. And we've got the hammer burst bolt blaster. That is a nice exploding spear upgrade though. And it offers two different types of spears. Stranger, are you looking to trade? Where's Catalo? What's he looking at? Is that at? the champion from the east I see? Then champion I've from something your to mom's share. House. That's a pretty view. This valley is infested with Regalus rebels. The scouts from the village tell us that they've been moving machines through here for days. Some they ride. Others they herd along, and some they even strip for parts. Especially cannons. The path ahead will not be easy. And we should get going. My orders are to guide you to the bulwark so that you can speak to Takote. For all the good it'll do. Not so fast. I'm gonna need a little more than that. Um, Stonecrest? What is this place? Stonecrest was built as an outpost, back when the clans were still at war. Its purpose was to guard the entrance to the valley, as well as keep watch on what happens below. And for now, that means keeping watch on Regala's forces. I wish we had enough soldiers to do more than just look on. You were at the embassy. I was. I'm sorry about the other marshals. And their deaths will not go unpunished. <clears throat> You're still healing. I will never heal. But that won't stop me from cracking any skulls that need it. <laughs> Good thing you're on my side. Then. They're gonna call him the Skull Cracker. Dude needs some good revenge. We gotta help him get some revenge. So, what's the plan? The bulwark is to the southwest, so undoubtedly we'll have to cross paths with Rogala's troops along the way. We'll either have to fight our way through, or find a way to sneak past unnoticed. Neither will be easy. Never is. <laughs> Let's get this over with. Honor and strength. All right. I really I want a good weapon upgrade before we go and do this, but <laughs> I guess we're not gonna. It's not gonna happen. All right. How would you convince Takote to send his challengers? I wouldn't. Uh, come on. To knock the respect of blade and the strength of the fighter who wields it. What good is anyone who lacks that? Well, lucky for us, we're both good fighters, but let's hope it won't come to that. Hmm. So we do know they at least know how to build bridges. Vehicle? Yes. They just don't the like clan to. Has defended it for generations. Against who? The other Tanakh clans. Even the Karja, long ago. For how fast he's running, he's able to talk real smooth. Talk to the chaplains. Rebels <laughs> ahead. Hacking away at that machine. Got them. 
or sneak around. Oh, we're gonna ruin their freaking day. I'm gonna hit this dude in the face with a spear that explodes. Take them out! What? Hey! Oh, I missed. Let's teach them respect. No! Wait, what? Trouble did, here! Does it not explode when you hit humans with it? That's so disappointing. Oh, dude, this guy is like that one boss that we fought not too long ago. Oh, get wrecked, son. Where's the other guy at? Oh, got it right in the balloon knot. Onwards to the bulwark. I'm so sad that that headshot did not explode. That would have been so cool. So I just wasted my ammo. Those rebels were gathering machine parts, maybe to make more overrides. And Takote won't do anything? Why would he, when he has the bulwark? I grew up behind the wall. It's easy to have a false sense of safety there. More Ooh, rebels those? in the clearing. Take the lead. All right, yep. Yeah, so we definitely have more here than last time. The shield guys are the most annoying. So if I can hit the shield dudes with an exploding spear of death, I feel like that would be the most efficient way of dealing with these, right? So if we hit them like right here. I'm coming, hold on. <laughs> when, I love it when a plan comes Stay together. Right there. There is some She's good. <laughs> Love it. Oh, why is that ram trying to help? No! Aren't you dead yet? There we go. Now let's go. <laughs> that worked too well. I'm telling you, the Exploding Spear of Doom is my favorite weapon in the whole game. I just need more of them at all times. I can turn this around. Where did Dude Bro go? There he is. Oh. Back to battle, Aloy. There we go. Come on, buddy. The Dude really hates defeated. machines. He could have just left that thing alone. What you doing, dude, bro? What? I gotta follow you. Go do something. <laughs> He's like, I'm just gonna run through the woods, man. I don't care. Yeah, that poor machine was just trying to mind its own business, and uh, Catalo here was like, mm -mm, not today, bro. Back at Stonecrest, you said the rebels have been moving through here for days. By the time Takote realizes he's outmatched, this entire valley might be overrun. If not for the sake of the rest of the clan, I would welcome that day. To see his pride ruined. Here it is. We don't teach the like Katala. Let me know when you are ready. Now will announce us. So oh, dude, I. I'm so ready. Let's go. Dolly looking pretty good for a one arm dude. That's pretty. You there! A marshal requests an audience with your clan commander. I didn't know there were any marshals left. We defend the path to the mountain, where the wings of the ten shall find us. All right, Marshal. I'll send the lift for you. 
I'm assuming that was a code. Because that dude was like, ah, oh, all right. I also want to know how they're not freezing to death uh, and nettles because it looks very cold there. Aloy has mentioned many times how cold she is. And this dude is way more naked than we are. Oh, why is that precarious? When we meet with Dakota, I'll do the talking. We'll see how it goes. Is she worried that this mountain is going to get taken down? Back again. So this was home. A long time ago. Come on. Through. Interesting. So we have the bulwark here. So this is another training area. We've got a stash there. We've got a potions person. Oh, yeah, that's what I was looking for. Always got to check what kind of new weapons are in each area. We got the pyre hunting bow. Interesting. So this is fire and armor breaking and something else. Burning enemy damage. Exacting sharp shot bow. Man, still nothing very good. I mean, this one's not terrible. I think, like, after upgrading this, this would probably be quite a bit better than our current stuff. But I think I already know what bow I'm going to buy. It's, uh, like, a, it's a purple weapon from, uh, like, Sharp Tooth Town or something. I don't know what the hell the name of the town was. It's in the desert somewhere. That's a terrible wound. <gasps> Armor. Oh my god. The Osaram Arrow Breaker. Critical strike plus trap limit and melee damage. That doesn't look bad. The Karha Wanderer. Quick Trapper and Resilient Trapper. Looks pretty cool. So, I've been thinking. Well, this is a warm welcome. An outlander and a maimed marshal. A spectacle. Reminds me of where I grew up. I never decided which was worse. When they shunned me, or when they stopped and stared. Right now, I prefer shunned. This is it. Ready. Well, this is gonna go well. We're here for Takote. Let us in. Dude is going to town on that chicken leg. The Sky Clan's mighty son returns. Bless the Ten. Your chief has demanded an immediate dispatch of all challengers to the Cool Root. We're here to make sure yours haven't gotten lost on their way to the Grove. I see. Regala must have dealt our chief a mighty blow, if he's sending you two as messengers. This one defeated Regala's champion, Grutta, at the embassy. She fought honorably. I had the sense to bar our soldiers from that embassy. Hey, thank you for the sub! Just as I have the sense now, to keep our challengers here. If they must fight, then they will fight here. Defending our walls. Our clan. That wall won't protect you. Not from the machines Regala controls. They're already at your doorstep. <laughs> and what do you know of the battles that the Bulwark has withstood? The blood shed upon stone. I know it wasn't meant to be used as a coward's shield. Ooh. And be fighting words, buddy. You were a great warrior once. Oh, he just pat his then. chopped off arm. You tell Hakaro. What a dick! With all due respect, that we will keep our challengers here 
for as long as we are safe behind the bulwark. I think this dude needs to be pimp slapped. I told you, words are useless with his kind. We're gonna have to kill him. It won't be easy with all his men above. Are you even listening? She's about to bring down the wall. For as long as we are safe behind the bulwark, he's- She's about to take down the wall. Wait here. I need to get a closer look at that wall. What? Why? That's just rude. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe we're about to do this. <laughs> She's just mean. She's like, ah, oh, this whole town is protected by this wall. Let me take it down. I don't care if I kill hundreds of people in the process. I need to get down to the base of it and check it out. What a savage. Just permanently opening up this town for future destruction. You. In the name of the <laughs> Alright, am I gonna repel down? Use the left, there we go. Oh, just you wait. I need to get a little distance from the wall in order to scan it properly. Maybe she's just gonna do a little damage to the wall and not fully take it down? But something tells me she's gonna okay. fully take it down. Time to scan the wall. Yep, right there. <sighs> just what I thought. There's something metal in there. Oh, that rock is interfering with the scan. I need to get closer. But how? I might be able to climb up on the left side of the wall. Near that waterfall. What? Oh, wait. Is my WoW internet working better than Spectrum? Uh, we had a little bit of a dip there. Um, I'm not honestly sure if it's working so well yet. Where but we're going to keep testing it. From? Climb, climb. The water's flowing into the wall. Towards a hollow, maybe. Whoops. The rocks here might give way. I pry it up. It's an awfully convenient hole into the mountain. Little did they know that their mountain is hollow and weak, primed for destruction from one human. Now, oh. better scan that tank again. Power core. I'll bet if I blew it up. But how? Are you well, serious? Can't do anything else here. Better go find Catalo. Okay, so we're not blowing it up yet, but she's definitely thinking about it. Uh, but to answer your question, no, I don't think uh, WoW is performing any better than uh, Spectrum, unfortunately. I think it's just due to the limitations of the network that's around here, because Columbus is stuck in the Stone Ages of technology. Although new building areas, like new developments, are getting uh, integrated with fiber, but not old ones. The guard said you've been scurrying around the wall like a rat. What in the name of the ten have you been up to? Takote said he wouldn't send his challengers as long as they're safe behind the bulwark, right? But don't remind me. So, we take it down. So rude. Did you hit your head on the way down here? I'm serious. There's something from the old world stuck in there, and it has a power cell. I could blow it up if I just penetrate the first layer of rock and Even metal. Even if what you're saying is true, it would take a cannon to do that. You're right. And you said the rebels were stripping them off machines back in the valley. <sighs> Come on. No. I'm not getting dragged further into this madness. Hikaru ordered you to help me. You gonna defy him like that arrogant shit up there? Oh, <laughs> called his ass out. Aloy don't play no games. That's why I like Aloy. She's a beast. That was an unkind comparison. <laughs> I also love that it's Charles uh, voicing. The might have made camp northeast of here. This particular gentleman. <laughs> what? The two of us go Ooh, against snap. all of them. I don't need to be throwing those at things. Pretty much, yeah. Oh, well, you may lack sense. But you don't like courage. So, um, mm, back I there, got that big with horn sheep bone for you. It seemed like there's bad blood between you two. 
There is. If we make it through this plan of yours, perhaps I'll tell you. I'll hold you to that. I am very We're curious about the bad blood. We saw the rebels before. It looks like there's a big rebel camp here. Well, it looks like the rebels just got a lot more firepower. Oh! Ready? Snap! What? That seems like a horrible idea. Am I gonna... Do I have to fight this thing? You wanted your cannon, and that thing has them. This won't be easy to take down, especially with this. I'll handle the big guy. You focus on the others. I'll follow you in. Of course, this would be the time that the internet starts dying. Doing my best to uh, try and fix it right now. Uh, hold on. Hopefully that fixed it. OBS just fully crashed. So I think it was an OBS issue and not necessarily a... Uh, internet issue um, but we'll just give it a second for everybody to refresh just in case because the uh, took a big old dump of rooski there but we back we back we back about to take down a big old elephant of death um, but yeah let's go ahead and try and do this are we gonna kill it maybe I should the tremor see if there's tusk. anything I can use to take that thing down and the rebels My focus can help we need to get this dude out. We march. All right. Well, so what's it weak to? It's weak versus frost damage, and it's in the frost area, which is odd. Uh, strong versus fire damage. What about explosive <laughs> damage? Yeah. We got a lot of these dudes around. I feel like maybe I should assassinate them and then kill the giant elephant. <gasps> we don't like having a neck. Oh my god! I stabbed him in the dick. That is just rude, Aloy. God. At least, like, cut his throat. Don't stab dudes in the dick. That's just messed up. Unnecessary roughness. There's another dude over here. Oh, snap. I just got shot in the butthole. What the hell was that? Big old stompy feats? Yeah, it does have big old stompy feats, that's for sure. Dude, stabbed her through a tree. Alright, so this thing's weak to ice. And everything else. So I think we just go in for the kill, right? We're gonna try and freeze it. Dude just ran in there! Not a care in the world. What a beast! Get that right in the belly. Oh, God dang, that did a lot of damage. Oh my God! That elephant is having a rough day. I almost feel bad. Cool girls don't look at explosions, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Is there a dude still trying to shoot me? <laughs> You're dead, son. Bye. Oh, he just... Oh, snap. First person to hit me in this fight. Hit me again. What a dick. Gonna need you to die now. There we go. Tay, thank you for the five gift subs, so, sweet baby Jesus. Thank you so much. I'm not looking forward to hauling this all the way to the bulwark. Here. 
I may be maimed, but I've still got a strong back. Dude's about to carry this for me with one arm. What a beast. Go, Charles. Eloy doesn't even say thank you. She did look at him proudly, though, which I think is a pretty good win for him. Charles is the man in all games. Hey. I you agree. Well back there. I did not think we'd survive. But killing the rebels and the machine. It was good to take the fight to them for once. Zaya, how have Memphis. you been? Thing will do the job. Glad to see you here. Oh, no, soon enough. Yeah, we need to get we need to get him a robo arm is what we need. Like he deserves it for sure. He needs a winter soldier arm. Oh, he just tied it to his back. What a beast. I hope he's the one that gets to take down the wall. Turn to the bulwark. We are here. Now what? Oh, oh. Oh, look at that. brought the chill. Here it There's is. There's a perfect mountain for it. But you don't just need a cannon. You need a miracle. Coming right up? Well, go on. Emily! I miss Tagstream sharing the love. Thank you, Emily. I'm glad to see you back. Okay. Gotta blast away some rocks. So I can expose Thank the you power so much. cell. It's working! Nothing's exploding. Oh, it will. This isn't gonna work. Well, isn't this impressive? Two children playing siege. I hope they haven't hurt the bulwark's feelings. Come now, stop embarrassing yourself. <laughs> this dude has one chance before we end his whole alone. life. This is your last chance, Takote. You can still answer Hikaru's call. This is your last chance. You have it backwards. Leave this place, Savage, now, and take this cripple with you. Called my boy a cripple. <laughs> His face. Oh no. Well, now that we've ruined this whole town's protection. What have you done? Can't hide behind the wall anymore, Takote. Now you have to join Hikaru. Never. Never. We will. We will rebuild it. Immediately. You are not safe. The bulwark couldn't protect you from a single cannon, let alone an army of machines. The only pathway to safety is to unite against Regala with your chief. You decreed that no challengers would be sent, while the clan remained safe behind the bulwark. So send them now, unless your word means nothing. Send them. I didn't hear you. Send the challengers. I look forward to seeing the Sky Clan's colors in the arena. <laughs> Nicely done, Marshal. What's gonna happen to this place? They'll have to live without their wall. But that's better than living apart from the tribe as pawns into Kote's foolish schemes. If you want to check up on them, talk to Jera, the chaplain of the clan. If anyone needs help up there, she'll know. Yeah. Well, that's good. Maybe At I least will. we get to take my assist leave, them I need in to the future. Hikaru. After completely screwing them the over. Good.
We may need another miracle there as well. Their leader's about to go cry now. You dare you take down my wall? <laughs> Maybe I should go up there, see if everyone's all right. <laughs> yeah, and you find just... this chaplain, Gara. You ruined their whole that village. Would be a good idea to resupply before I head back out. God, do I still have to take the lift up? <laughs> oh, that was unfortunate. Getting screwed over is part of I'll growth, right? I ruined your protection. Y'all okay? <laughs> Yeah, They're it's it's kind of ridiculous. Does she have new things for us? You, Outlander, come and. Um. Oh, we've got different types of coils and weaves, though. Ice fire blasting. Oh, this has fire and ice. We need an elemental claw strider circulator. So a lot of these things need the elemental claw strider circulator. So maybe we should get some of those. Really. There's nothing you want. But, uh, we need to go back to the Memorial Grove, which is all the way back down here. We should be able to fast travel back there. But also... I need to figure out where those elemental claw strider dudes are. Can you imagine the audacity of her to immediately go into this town after destroying their wall? I'm surprised they aren't killing her on sight. Exactly! Like, he, she just ruined their lives, potentially. And, and she's just like, nah, everything's fine. Okay, there we go. So there's the claw striders there. So let's fast travel there. See if we can take some of them down. Ooh, it's a bit cold down here. Tell you what. Oh, they're like right here. I haven't fought some claw striders in the snow before. I gotta say, I'm a, I'm a little nervous with the whole visibility aspect of this. Right, because claws and shredding jaws run enough. Oh snap! There it is. Gonna need you to die now, homie. Bye bye. <laughs> that wasn't so bad at all. Even though I was nervous about it. Is there another one here? Oh, snap! Oh, Christ. I'll tell you what, the, uh... Those freaking... Exploding spears are so goddamn good. Oh, trying to hit it in its belly. There we go. Oh! Christ! That's why that first one took so much damage. I freaking exploded its belly. Whoops, whoops, whoops. I don't know what's happening. Stop. Oh, no, I missed. All right, how about you just get exploded? How's that sound? Oh, bye-bye. <laughs> yep, that uh, piercing blast bolt threw some acid. Turns out it hurts. Hurts a lot. 
So we've got the elemental claustrider primary nerve. I think that's what we needed to uh, to craft those More items. I can send it to my stash. Which is pretty cool. Pretty cool indeed. Back through here. Actually, I guess we can just fast travel back to the coal route. I think they should have a fast travel point in there. Yeah. Time is it? It's one thirty seven. Better pass. Outlander, Chief Akaro and Marshal Katalo await you within. Um, but. Ladies and gentlemen, I feel like this is probably probably a good spot to stop for the day. Um, at least for here, because I got some other things that I want to record. I got to figure out what I'm going to stream on the tubes tonight as well. Uh, but thank you all so much for hanging out with me, you wonderful, wonderful humans. Also got to figure out what's going on with the internet, because it's unstable on all fronts now. I got to fix that. But uh, I do hope you all have a fantastic night, or day, or whatever. <laughs> And uh, I'm sure we'll be streaming either here or on YouTube later tonight.